Wolf Pack. I'm Paul Sabulwell. And I'm Gabby Bonblon. Today is Thursday, October 14th, and we're here with your morning announcements. Attention seniors, the last time to take your senior portraits will be on October 31st. If you love competitions and are looking for ways to boost your college resume, then History Day is perfect for you. Come check out what History Day is all about at our info session today at 3.30 in HN4. You can also talk to Ms. Dietrich in HN4 or send her an email. Attention seniors, starting on October 20th, the workshops will be for the CSU and UC applications, followed by another application Q&A. All PowerPoints from the previous workshops are in the Career Center website for you to refer to while you are working on your applications. Now let's check out this anti-bullying message. inspirational. Now let's pass it on to Dylan and Josiah for sports. What's crack a lack in Wolfpack? I'm Dylan Brazier. And I'm Josiah Edwards. Let's get into your sports update. Last night our women's volleyball team had a pink out game against PG and won 3-0. Looking good ladies. For all students wanting to go to the football game this Friday, there will be pre-game ticket sale in HD7 during both lunches. It's 5 bucks for students and 7 bucks for adults. Tickets will be available until tomorrow, so get them ASAP. Tomorrow our cross country team is traveling to Chico for an all day race. Good luck team. In NFL news, the Buccaneers will demolish the Eagles tonight in a prime time game. Okay, well we'll see. If Jalen Hurts can have a good game and our defense doesn't fold, we might be able to pull off the upset. Okay, keep dreaming. That's all, for your, that's all we have for you today. Back to the anchors. Thanks guys. All first term textbooks are now due except AP textbooks which are kept all year. Ask your teachers which days this week you are dropping off your books as a class in the library. If you miss your class drop-off day, please come before or after school to turn in your books. The library will be closed at lunch until October 18th due to textbook returns and checkouts. Want to go to a 49ers game? Enter the library's Reimagine a Book Cover contest. Pick a book and make a new cover for it using art and imagination. Email or stop by the library to let them know which book you will be using. First prize is a set of 49er football tickets or a $50 gift card of your choice. Pumpkin Palooza is back. Team up with a teacher and decorate your pumpkin for a chance to win a $15 Target gift card. Carving is not allowed, but you can decorate your pumpkin with paint or any other decorations. Sign-ups are due Monday, October 18th. Pick up your pumpkin from the leadership room after school on Friday, October 22nd. Pumpkins are due Thursday, October 28th, and voting on the best pumpkin will occur during the fall festival that night. The categories are scariest, most creative, CO spirited, and funniest. Check your Synergy email on how to sign up. We can't wait to see your amazing designs. Now let's tune in to another episode of Teacher of the Week. My name is Steve Batiz. I went to um, Cal State University Sand Vlog, which is in Turlock. Um, I studied physics there. I got a degree in physics and then I also got my credential there. Technically this is my second year. They, um, my first year was during the COVID pandemic. I taught eighth grade science. Eighth grade is a very interesting. And then I came here to teach high school for physics. Since I was a kid, I played school with my family and I was always a teacher. I always made makeshift worksheets. But honestly, I really enjoyed helping others. I tutored physics at the college level for about three years and I just loved it. I like to work out. I enjoy working out a lot. I work out every morning before work. Huge hobby here. I don't know why I'm just comparing this. I like dancing at all times. Like, so a little shimmy here and a little shimmy there. Um, if you see me with my earphones in, especially across campus, most likely gonna be rocking out to somebody like Beyonce or something like that. And I will like maybe do the finger wag every occasionally. Uh, in class, I'm dancing. I'm dancing a lot. The one thing I can tell seniors is to Keep trying, don't give up, and surprise yourself. You, it, it, it's amazing what you can accomplish when you put your mind to it. And I know that's like a common trope, but I, I'm serious, you know. Oh, I, I would say I'm enjoying my stay here at CO. This has been an absolute blast. The students have been so much fun. So thank you. Thank you for allowing me to be me. 
Thanks, Mr. B. Now here's Ms. Henderson with some announcements. Hello. I have important information about Powder Puff football and cheer signups. In an effort to make Powder Puff signups more equitable, leadership has decided to change the original plan, so please pay attention. Tomorrow at 3.20 p.m., I will email out on Synergy a link for a Google form to sign up for Powder Puff cheer and football. Be sure to pay attention to which link you click. Google Forms will be timestamped, and the first 32 of each grade level will be the participants. Then, by late lunch on Monday, October 18th, you will need to come to the leadership room to turn in your paper application. Things that can disqualify you from participation. If you do the Google Form before 3.20 p.m., so if I send it out at 3.15, don't do it until 3.20. Or if you do not turn in a completed application by the deadline late lunch on Monday. If you have any questions, please come see me in the leadership room. Well, that's all we have for today, Wolf Pack. I'm Paul Sabulo. And I'm Gabby Bomblon. Remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Dessert, Dessert Day, Wolf Pack.